Bible. God said as a result of my children not doing what their father said, don't do this and do this, he would curse us as a race of people. Now I'm asking you a question. Do our people look to be blessed today? Probably not. You know how we know we're not blessed? Cause we got a we got something called Black Lives Matter where we gotta beg white people to stop killing us. That's right. You gotta beg your oppressor to stop killing you. Like, and, like he cares. Like he built his entire country, his entire empire off your back. Now he's gonna give it. back. He's gonna stop doing the thing. That's, that's like that's like you ever uh, grow up. You ever grow up playing like video games and like you may have been doing the same thing you button I don't know you stop doing the same thing but it keep working for you you keep winning but that's basically what he's doing he's not gonna stop we tell him hey man stop doing the same move and he like but it's working he gonna keep doing the same move he's not about to stop doing what built him America is a young country is it not and it became the most powerful country in the world in a matter of a couple of centuries wake him up how because of the free labor off of the backs of your people. That's right. That's, right. that's what happened. That's right. So if, if that's what happened, why do we have to sit up there and beg? Why are we going to beg the person that became the most dominant nation on the planet by doing the same thing that he always done? He's not going to change. He's going to continue doing the same thing because he's winning. We got to do something different. That's Does right. that make sense? That's right. Read what you got. So it said, because we broke the commandments, we will be cursed as a people, right? Read what you got, verse 16. Verse 16, cursed shall thou be in the city. Now, in the cities, in like the major cities of the world. Let's say America right now, right? Because many of us might not have traveled. We have, but many people might not have traveled. But in the city, where do our people live? Right. Where where we getting killed, we eat bad food, we drink bad water, our mothers, baby mamas, our brothers, baby daddies are in prison. Babies are shooting each other. That's a curse, right? In the city, right? Do everybody else live like that in the city? No. The Bible says the Israelites for breaking God's laws will be cursed in the city. Read. And cursed shall thy be in the field. And at one point in time, we served in the sugarcane fields. We served in the cotton fields. We served in the tobacco fields, the rice patties. We were both cursed in the field and in the city. So what people fit that curse? Everybody? I wish the sister was still up here because the sister, when she would not answer the question, has this happened to everybody else? And the reason why is because we got the white man on our brain. We gotta get him off our brain. He's right. good. He's doing fine. He's doing very well for himself. His face is on the money. He owns all of the land. He has a military behind him. He he do what he want. He do what he want and nobody stops him. So why I gotta worry about him? Right. Let that man be him. Let him deal with his people. I'm cool with that. He doing what he supposed to do. We need to do what we supposed to do. That's right. Let's get another one. Get verse uh, 33. Matter of fact, give me verse 64. That's 64. Where's the one that say uh, uh, 61? That's the one I want. Watch this. I'm gonna get something that's more pertinent to today, right? Because maybe slavery in the fields don't really matter to us today. What about? So I want y'all to pay attention to this sign, right? Right. We're gonna read a curse. We're gonna re <laughs> we're gonna read a curse. And then we're going to read another curse back to back. Watch this. Now you tell me who this applies to. And remember, we're talking about the Israelites. Read. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 64. Read. And the Lord shall scatter thee. The Lord shall what? Scatter thee uh -huh. among all people. How would that happen? Look at this sign. They've been scattered among all races of people. Our people are in China. Our people are in Iraq. Our people are in Iran, Syria, Egypt, Afghanistan, Africa, East India, West India, Jap Japan, America, Latin America, Kuwait. We everywhere. That's why I told the sister earlier, every race of people had us in slavery. We think that just this white man had us in slaves. This, if this man was selling slaves, who was he selling them to? That's Just right. white people? No, because no. no other race of people went into slavery like we did. That's so, right. so did, were they just standing back? No, Mr. White Man, I don't like that. No, they, they, you built the Great Wall of China. You built those, those, those towering castles and things in England. You built those things. Right. You built the pyramids in Egypt. That's right. You built those, those infrastructures because you were slaves when they were erected. Right. For free. Right. So read it again. And the Lord shall scatter thee among all people. So we will be scattered via slavery among all races of people from one end of the earth 
even unto the other. From one side of the earth to the other side of the earth. Right? Read. And there thou shalt serve other gods, uh -huh. which neither thy nor thy fathers have known, even wood and stone. Right, that's your Christianity, that's your Islam, right? So when we were scattered, not only would we be indoctrinated with a bunch of Nazis, we would also be indoctrinated with other gods. This yeah. is why, like the sister was saying, what about the other people? What about skin color? I've never said skin color once. Right. I've only said one race of people, nationality, yeah. and the things that happen to our people. That is it. The only way that happens is because, like he, they said, when we were scattered, we were made to serve other gods. This white man is a god now. Right. And our people cannot see salvation for our people except it comes through him. That's it. That's what that, So when you hear a person sitting up there, when you're talking about, man, that was messed up, how they gunned down our people, and you hear somebody talk about, well, all lives matter. That's hip talk for, well, what about the white man? Right. That's hip right. talk for that. Right. Because they don't care about nobody else. That's called Stockholm Syndrome. Right. You have been in captivity so long that you have an affinity to this man. Right. You can't see life without him now. Yeah. That's why when our people try to gather, don't it's always our people that's trying to stop it. Right. Yeah. Don't, hey man, this, this man, I got a good gig here, man. You're going to mess it up for everybody. Right. But when, when did our people have it good here? Yeah. Never. I'll wait, go ahead. Never. 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 We've never had it good here. You might have a good job, and yet right. when the police pull behind you, you get scared as hell. You get scared as hell. Ain't Why? did nothing. Your license good. Ain't did nothing. Good. You, no, you just death. got your whole junk clean. You know, it, see, if they, they don't, right, they don't know. Don't if, say that. If, if they don't, right, if they don't come up to the window and see a black person in there. So you might be driving something, they might think it's a white man in there. So yeah. why you tense up when that police come on you? Because you and they, they we all know that, that we're not good here. That's right. They'll we know us. we're not good here. Kill us for on the right, right day, it can be all bad. That's right. Right? Now, I'm going to read that in the Bible. Because it said we were scattered amongst the other races of people. Yeah. Now what else? Read. Verse 65. Uh -huh. And among these nations shall thy find no ease. You got to work till you, our, pe our average person retires at like 80 something years old. You too old to enjoy anything now. You can't travel. You don't want to go out. You don't want more to lawn. You damn sure don't want to buy a house because you got to maintain that. And ain't nobody maintaining no house at 80 years old. You ain't got no ease. You got to work all your life for, for Social Security that ain't worth nothing. Some people still got to work a job on Social Security. We all, all eat dog food. We eating that anyway, sis, but I'll I touch on that later. I'm talking about our people. The Bible say the food we, ain't, we eating is not good food. Yeah, it, it's still yeah, yeah, given to you by that man, right? <laughs> Alright, read what you got. Neither shall the sole of thy foot have rest. Uh -huh, you ain't got no rest. But the Lord shall give thee there a trembling heart uh -huh. and failing of eyes. Right. So when that police pull behind you, mm -hmm. you get that heart, get the pumping. Or really any, you around a, a bunch of Caucasians and they get riled up. That chest get the pumping a little bit because they got some power that you don't got, and they can put you to death and going. I was afraid of my life and the big scary nigger tried to kill. Right, that's what happens. Right, that's what happens. And now you, you, you the victim, but now you the problem, and and the murderer is the victim. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling These are how our men repented at heart The scriptures is proof IUIC, we deliver the truth